Hi children, this is your summer for teacher. Today we are going to learn a new chapter. Let's keep our classroom clean. In the last chapter, we learned about good manners. In this chapter, we will see how we keep our classroom clean. Okay. A clean and organized classroom creates a good atmosphere for students and teachers. The school and its surroundings must be kept clean always. Cleanliness should be taken as the first and the foremost responsibility by everyone. Everyone should understand that cleanliness is as necessary as food and water. Cleanliness means keeping one's body, dress, surroundings and mind clean. A clean school begins with a clean classroom. How can we keep our classroom clean? Yeah, that's right. Now let's see how we can keep our classroom clean. Okay, the first one. We must clean our classroom by sweeping and mopping. We should keep our classrooms, chairs and desks clean and arranged properly. We must not scribble or keep unwanted things on classroom walls. We must keep books, lunch boxes and water bottles at the right place marked by the class teacher. We must put all rubbish in the dustbins provided by our school. We should display all drawings and handbooks. We must respect and appreciate all students' drawings and handwork. Thank you so much for watching this video. Okay, children, let us work together to keep our classroom clean and tidy. Again, thank you so much for watching this video and see you all in the next chapter.